Two weeks ago, I got this surprising email saying congratulations. And actually at the time, I didn't believe the email and I was really, it was, it was too unreal. And I emailed the Play Magnus support staff and they told me it was legitimate. So I'm here to play Magnus Carlsen in a chess game. I don't know if we'll call it playing, but <laughs> I'm about to be beaten by Magnus Carlsen <laughs> in a chess game. I have a few idols and my first idol in chess was Bobby Fischer and then now it's Magnus Carlsen and just to meet him it's a dream, it's like a dream come true. When you hear about someone who becomes Grandmaster at the age of 13, it's hard to conceptualize what that actually is, how good they actually are at such a young age. But when you actually, when it actually happens, you, you know, you have to uh, stop being full of yourself and realize he's kind of, you know, the greatest thing that's ever happened to Jess. It's demoralizing. <laughs> it's demoralizing, yeah. We're at the Marshall Chess Club. We've been here since 1915. This is our 100th year anniversary. Every champion since Capablanca has set foot in this chess club. Actually, this board right here to my left, uh, I believe every world champion since Capablanca has sat at this board. And now Magnus is here. Hi, nice to meet you. I played him two years ago. I lost in 17 moves, and he plays the move kind of slow motion, not like a very fast motion. Do you know the Lucina position? Uh-oh, so. I hope I'm world champion in about 10 years. I'm sure you'll beat your first Grandmaster before that. Hopefully. <laughs> no nerves. It's just anxious to get started. <laughs> I was definitely surprised by his speed. It was a little unnerving actually. A lot of pressure just came from the fact that he was at your board so quickly. Basically how it felt was like a storm closing in on me and I could see the dark clouds coming faster and faster and then it was over. I would have weaknesses here that you can attack, but now my pieces are well developed. Well, this experience playing with Magnus has really taught me something. And I, well, first thing, I didn't know I could be wiped out so quickly. And second, I've never seen a storm coming that fast. He has a persona. You know that when you play him, you're playing against the best player in the world. And just like he humbled me with his Magnus 7 and 8 play, he's uh, humbling me again. The world of chess, he really is the pinnacle. I knew that before, but it's different when you actually meet someone and watch them play. You understand a lot better than if you just flip through a game online.